if this was a condition in which you were there for a few months, it might be okay. If not, you know, but if you were in a condition like um, like this, or in confinement with condition like this for up to 10, 15, 20, 30 years, well, it kind of catches up with you. When I was in prison, I asked me what kept me going. I, I would probably tell you the fact that I was innocent and I needed to get out of prison. Uh, and my main focus was to stay as sane as I could in order to accomplish this. As Alvin and Herman are still in solitary-like conditions, and both were charged with allegedly participating in the death of a correction officer. But again, since that time, all evidence showed that they were targeted simply because they were members of the Black Panther Party and that there's really no evidence, you know, no forensic or otherwise physical evidence linking them to the crime. Like I say, when I think about the 10 years in which, you know, I've had time to be out here, that is 10 more years that they are there. When they went to prison, the prison was considered the worst in the nation, and they got people together. They brought in the ideology that despite the fact that you were a prisoner, you, were, you still had some rights. And because of this, the administration saw them as being threats. fearful of crime. So whenever one is charged with a crime, a lot of time it doesn't make a difference whether or not this person is innocent or guilty. They feel, some people feel, and I've heard jurors say, well, this individual here, they must have done something. This is the type of mentality that is cultured. I mean, it is, you know, nurtured in, 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 in the American society. I think while we focus on the condition of confinement, I think the bigger focus is on prison. I think we have to begin to see prison as being a tantamount or equal to slavery. I think people in the United States need to know that uh, the 13th Amendment did not abolish slavery. Instead, the 13th Amendment, you know, if you read the word and it says slavery and involuntary servitude shall exist on these shows except one who has been duly convicted of a crime. How many people who have been duly convicted of crime but who are actually innocent? Because as long as we have prison, slavery reigns. <laughs>